Welcome to County Report This Week. I'm Lorna Virgili, and thank you for joining us. The Montgomery County Drug Court Program is a volunteer program that offers individuals with drug or alcohol dependency problems the chance for change. Susan Kennedy has a story. I used drugs for over 15 years of my life. Um, I was addicted to cocaine. I did not care about myself, my family, my children. I lost my children with my addiction. Um, I was evicted. I've been in and out of jails numerous times, and I just did not have any hope. I did not have a care in the world. The only thing I cared about was getting high. That was more than six years ago. Today, Angela Brown is clean and sober thanks to the Montgomery County Drug Court Program. Before entering the program, she had been to jail numerous times and her chances at life were about to run out. I took it because at that point I knew that I didn't have anywhere to go once I would be released from jail and I knew that I needed help. The Drug Court Program was started 10 years ago by Judge Nelson Roop, a Montgomery County Circuit Court judge since 1997 Roop saw plenty of the same drug-related offenders over and over again in his courtroom, and he thought there had to be a better way to break the cycle. And the cycle is the traditional method of sentencing, the nonviolent addicted offender just doesn't work. So in order to address that, which requires treatment, intense supervision and monitoring, uh, we decided to start a drug court in Montgomery County. The Montgomery County Drug Court is a two-year program that couples substance abuse treatment with close judicial supervision in lieu of jail. Councilmember Phil Andrews is a big supporter of the drug court program. We all benefit when uh, people who uh, can be safe in the community and be productive citizens are doing that rather than locked up. Judge Roop and Judge Quirk do amazing work with the uh, Health and Human Services team, uh, working closely with the uh, state's attorney, with uh, uh, the corrections department, with the sheriff, with uh, uh, others as well, and with employers who uh, sponsor uh, the, uh, the folks in the program. Uh, one of the conditions of the program is you got to work. Recently, the program graduated its latest group of participants. To date, there have been 140 drug court graduates, and the program has an 85 percent success rate. Councilmember Andrews and numerous other officials were on hand to congratulate the graduates, including County State's Attorney John McCarthy. I've got a song for you. The, oh. Our graduates are going to lead us in dance, and please join us today. Come on. Some people come into the program to get an opportunity to get your life together. The program saved my life. I'm happy. I'm at peace. Without it, I would definitely be on the street or dead. I wouldn't be in jail. I would be dead. In Rockville, I'm Susan Kennedy for County Report This Week.